の星はまだ勝ち進んでいるのかは銀河辺境 A ブロック予選を勝ち抜きグランドセレスタ本戦に駒を進めましたご心配には及びません我らの未来を脅かす青い星の者たちは必ずや排除いたします伝説の話父上も信じておられたな世界に危機が訪れし時我らが未来は七つの光の先にある青い星の者たちに委ねられる亡きお父上様の仰せの通りその伝説が真実であったとしても恐れることはありません我らが四天王の手で地球は確実に敗北することになりますふん<笑><笑>エピソード6宇宙への旅立ち VS 砂の惑星サンドリアス代表イレブン Let's go! Okay, that's how I can say it. What up, Mavericks? It's me, Rick, and today we're playing once again in a Zuma 11 Go Galaxy Supernova. And now we're actually into the galaxy! It's been a while for right since now, and. Oh, I can't thank you, nice. Thank you guys enough for the support、uh, on the channel, and. Oh, it's amazing. It's been absolutely what Ariel here says. Amazing! It's amazing! It's like a sea of stars! So pretty! Look there! That's e r t isn't it? Huh? Where? Where? Look right there. Do you see it? Wow! It already is so small. We really are going to another planet, planet aren't we? We sure are. Ah,、uh, we're finally in space. They all made it. If the little, little ones are gonna be fine and fit. I'm just gonna make some stellar ride. Huh? What's that noise over there? Hmm. Has that box of oranges always been there? Hmm. I wonder. My b i r t h n a y s must be getting the best of me. Hmm. No. What was that box doing? Hmm. Arian, what are you still doing here? Everyone's gathered with the coach in the meeting car. I think he wants to talk about our next steps. Okay, got it. I'll, I'll have them now. The meeting car that, that's past all the boarding cars. Let's go! Need at the meeting room. But can I? Oh. Okay. <clears throat> Rioma, Faye, Gabby. Okay, let's put the elephant out of the room. We're gonna swap Trina out for. We're gonna have Eric. On the team. Sorry, Falco, I love ya, but Dodgers need to be on the team. And who else got stripes? You don't add much to my squad. Zeppe for s h o n I'm gonna put Mark as the second goalkeeper, but for whom? t o r i s t e sorry, t o r i s t e We haven't had much from you, we haven't seen much of you, Jordan. Because we're in out of space right now. Ooh. Ooh, woo. It's just a laugh. I don't want to say z e p e f a l o t but it might be. And that's basically how the team is being structured for. As for now, the story team is. Getting its ass at the moment. 
the shot Eric as our center midfield player. Bay obviously in the midfield. We got Gabby in the fence. We're gonna put Stoll out there. Because Stoll, I love Stoll. And maybe Arian here for as for now. Or wait, you get do you get airbullet in this game? I can't remember. And Jordan. Ah, oh, did okay. This team. I don't know what to say. This team is. It's not the best team I've made, but it's a team I I love. With everyone being here, Buddy being my new one of my new characters, I'm gonna use. This is mostly a team that I'm gonna create in Great Trials of Heroes. Because oh, I love this so much! Okay, but enough of the enough of the bad talking, bad mounting. We're gonna put Eric in there, we're gonna put Mark uh, and Gabby of course. And then Eric needs to be behind Arya, and then Gabby needs to be behind Eric. Uh, I think Gabby is... I think Gabby is more of my favorite character than Endo or Mark. It's just the way it is. Look at them! Look at him! <laughs> hey Eric! 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 I want to tell you a secret. You're a great guy! Okay, let's go. Oh! Uh, Get the, the Eric hype has just begun, but oh, I still can't believe this dormitory was part of the vehicle. What's the difference be between space sick and sea sick? One's in space, the one is on sea. What if I get dizzy? That was more curious, this voice. Oh well, in space, there's a chance you can get space sickness. Captain, you should be aware of this. Arian, can't leave her now. Remember, we're in space. Oh no, we're in space. Let's do our tasks and be a good crewmate and not let the others think that we're the imposter. I know, you can laugh now. This kind of reminds me of Among Us. Another good joke, I know. Uh, truly, I'm. I am unworthy of the split gambit that's been created for me. I'm gonna try and do like a Xanarch voice. If you don't know, the Xanarch looks a lot like him, but. And that was the point. This room is free, right? I think I will be using it. No, th this, is the, this is the room that Eric will be sleeping in, okay, should we say? Eric gets his own whole room, so it's, it's not free. Hey, Captain, I can see the units from my window. You can do it, buddy. <clears throat> Looks like the meeting vehicle is just around the corner. Oh my god, we have we have a great guest crew. I mean, I, I think it's great because I chose them. You already know we were playing against in the first round. No, we don't. But we do have in a link. We finally made it into. We finally made it into space. It's so cool. Ah, it's so pretty. I can't let you see. Good snap. I can't wait to meet all sorts of aliens. Elise, I don't think you should post the sports online. I think that people might be more susceptible to motion sickness in space. Please take care, everyone. You should eat pickled plums if you have motion sickness. That's what my grandma says anyways. Pickled plum is so sour though. Haha, <laughs> there's a granny's boy. The universe holds many mysteries. Yeah. I think we should gather the fairest mysteries of the Orient Express here. That's spooky. Ooh, this'll be good. 
I don't think I read this right. Well, maybe. You're all way too excited. You made Italian. What? 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 What, Nani? Let's start with the meeting. Alright, let's go. What are we up against? In round one, we will announce our next step. The Grand Celestial Galaxy Tournament will take place in the Milky Way over one over 188,000 light years from Earth. Currently, we are making our way to our opponent's place for our first match. Hold on. If it's so far away, how will we get that coach? I agree. Even if we travel at the speed of light, it will take us 188,000 years to get there. W what? 188,000 years? You're joking, right? What gives? We're gonna be old men by the time we get there. Your concern is unfounded. We will simply warp to our destination. So, you're not saying the strength can warp us there, but how? Indeed. I guess. I see. The Galactic Federation are much more advanced than us. They're already able to warp. Amazing. I think we'd actually get to experience something like this. How exciting. Earl Eleven's first match will be against the planet by the name of Silica. The planet of Silica? Hmm. We will commence the walk tomorrow morning. Our direction has been altered to reach the appropriate warp zone. That is all. Return to, our, to your rooms at once. Okay. That night. <sighs> Ooh, little dream room. Wh where am I? Ah! Ah, a waterfall? No, sand. A waterfall made of sand. How is that possible? Wow! What are you? Wait! Don't go! Hold on! <clears throat> well, Arian, why are you following something into a dark cave? <laughs> well, we just seen the whole Legends of Zelda plot in one uh, quick cutscene. Oh, thank goodness, I'm away! That was a heck of a dream! Pikachu! Huh. Huh. Uh, what is that? Pikachu! Wait! Pikachu! 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 Oh, isn't she cute? What even is the thing? I don't know. When I woke up, it was just floating around my room. You don't know? Well, it must be some kind of step space creature. How did it even get in here? M my tree? Huh? What are you on about? It's the same creature that I saw in my dream last night. So you're saying that it escaped from your dream into the real world? That's completely impossible! Where's this now, Stippy? It's no surprise to see something beyond the world's imagination. Think about it. Hey! Ah, you! Hey, you gonna give her a name? You really want to name it? Well, uh, who knows some dog names or cat names, I guess? Whatever fits. 
It's like a fairy, a space fairy. But how about Pixie? This type of fairy, after all. And the name seems nice, regardless. Pixie! Yeah, I love it! We're naming her Pixie. W well, it's nice to meet you, Pixie. Pixie! Pixie joined the team and is now able to play football. Saka Yaruse, motherfucker. I need to cut that out. Nah. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> I think she's pretty fond of you, Harry. Take good care of her, okay? W what? Why me? Are you guys serious? Pikachu! Pikachu! Oh, Auntie finally found you, kids. I need you all in the dining car. Follow me, okay? Quickly, now! Quickly! Yes, ma'am! I wonder what it's all about. Show it off? Maybe it's bad. Only one way to find out if it's good or bad. Ah, but... Just do the walk of shame, shame area, like... We've just seen something worth really horrifying, really cute, and... Pixie! I love her! I can't believe Pixie just appeared like that! I wonder if, if what I saw really was just a dream. Pixie is so cute. So, so, so cute. Do you think it's okay to touch her? Everyone, you aren't being very elegant about this intruder. I think it's fine, Zippy. Pixie is thin any arm. You might turn it now, Aria. You might just come up sh short later, but we genuinely don't know about now. Oh, let's do some training. Let's do some training with the man. Let's do let's do this with the man, the man, the legend, Eric Eagle. Oh, let's see if I still. If I still can do it, but the chances of me failing this can be quite big because I haven't done this after the first time we've well done this. Uh oh. Oh, I need to get faster. Well, it's. I think I'm doing pretty okay. Right about now. It's nothing too bad. But it's also not great. It's. Right in the middle of okay and completely embarrassingly bad. So yeah, so yeah. Oh, let's go, let's go. I, I have dodged simply almost everything today. I am thinking I can set a new record for myself with being with playing as Eric. Uh oh, and like I said, this could be this could be like a great thing to do between YouTubers, like a little uh, what you call it, like a little Inazuma Eleven competition, but not uh, but not football or soccer, but just like a quick training competition between like the best Inazuma Eleven. YouTubers or in a chubas. Woo! Level 11, it's getting harder. We've di we didn't dodge two rockets, but it's fine. It's all be fine. Three rockets. It all started when I said that I was good at dodging things, and then it went all back to being. Not this 
good as I, as I was before. But as I was saying, I think I have perfected my score from the first time I did this, and this is. Oh, this is a bad. This is bad. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um. Yeah, Eric gets the crap beaten out of him. Well, it was fun while it lasted. My uh, three thousand two hundred. 30,200 points. Not a bad recovery skill, nice. Okay, we've got 10 points. Let's put some into cave, like 5 into cave. 2 here, and then we need some bull. We need to, like, he's a midfielder, we need more bala on him. Or more stamina. No, let's do more stamina. Oh. Uh, 2 and dribble, and the rest. Oh, here. Okay, let's go and well, let's do the let's do this one. And it's almost charisma, so this trading kind of fits the team <laughs> of real life. You need more speed, Jordan. You need way more speed. Okay, well, that was fun little bit. Okay. Oh, it's Swappe! I can't talk to Swappe. But let's talk to Auntie. Hey, hey! Look over there! Over there! A very own little stowaway. He hid himself in a box of oranges. Well, likely he says he's a friend of yours, Harry. JP! No way! It's you! Ayo! Let's address you properly. Everyone, this is Jean Pierre Lapin. Or JP for short. He's been my friend for ages. One year. Some about JP. So if I should get anyone by sneaking around, nice to meet you all. JP, oh yeah. I thought I recognized the little face of yours. You're a rhyming skipper, aren't you? What are you doing on a train? We see you in the Ryman 11 as, our, as Sam's uh, second goalkeeper, and you only played it for like 10 minutes. Coach? Hmm, I don't trust him. Let's vote him out and send him back into space. Coach Black, please, please, let JP play with our 11 2. Please, sir. I'll come I promise, I'll work hard. I'll follow everything you say. Hmm, everything? Yes, sir. Very well, I will allow you to stay. Oh, thank you so much, sir. Oh, JP, this is great. Yeah. I'm looking forward to playing some football with everyone! JP has joined us today! He's not into our space, he's not the imposter, but he joined us. But have you... <sighs> okay, I know what Ricardo said. Uh, good to have you back, JP. Um... Damn, I forgot my Italian accent! Got to have you back, JP. Got to have you aboard. Oh, what was that farting? <laughs> it makes me more think of a farting sound than, like, dummy rumbling sound. Oh. My wife, you're a hungry boy, aren't you? Sit yourself down. I'm just gonna go make your breakfast to fill you up, okay? Yeah, hey. We'll be walking after breakfast. Make sure you're all at the work at a quietly Prepared. Yes, sir. What thing, huh? Oh, this is so exciting. Yeah. But before that, food. I can play on an empty stomach. No, ah. <laughs> you sure have the right idea? Hey, I like this guy. 
Nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> So annoying. Is this really alright? He most certainly won't have had the capabilities you require. Hmm, just a hot thought. What? Are you saying you've evaluated him already? Someone like Sean, yeah, it's necessary for our current team. Do you think he carries a totem? Hmm. Hmm. If everyone is present, we have entered war range for Silica. Let us commence the war. Everyone, take your seats now. Make yourselves comfortable. Next up, Silica. The Orion Express can now go to the new area planet Silica. Okay. I can't go to her! No! Two, one... Time jump! No, <laughs> that's not the game press out. <clears throat> Silica. Ooh, I like the desert Eve vibe from this one. We have now docked at Silica. Silica? We already are on an extra solar planet, aren't we? This is... So, you are all for our safety. Marvelous. Azurok! I'm sure you are all aware. Silica is your first opponent in Grand Celesta tournament. And the first match too. Silica is known as the Plant of Sand. The surface is covered near entirely with different sands forming a vast desert. Desert? Wow! Having a fault in such a harsh place, the Silicas naturally have sprung something. I'm afraid to say it won't be such an easy match for you. <laughs> well then. With that out of the way, let the games begin. Needless to say, I'm sure you know that the fate of our planet is this rests on the outcome of this tournament. The fate of Earth. Well, I must be off now. Good luck to you all. Hmm. <laughs> all of that just won. All of that just trash talk us. And then he runs away. What a joke. Arian, I think we should head out. My Ricardo voice is just not on point today. I don't know what's been on my mind, but it's not good. Welcome, Earth 11, to Planet Silica. Ah, hello! Who, who are you exactly? I am a coordinator of the tournament. You may call me Metagallant. On orders from the Master Holder, I'm I am to welcome Earth 11 to this planet. Oh well, thank you very much. Free appreciated. You're welcome. Our match will take place tomorrow. The log time. Uh, the log time 1300 hours. A football stadium will be prepared before the match is due to start. P prepare? What do you mean? Gravitational pull of the planet varies depending on its size. This puts the away team. Significant downside. Would recommend that you familiarize yourselves with the environment before you start this due to st before the match is due to start. You're free to do as you wish before the match starts tomorrow. Some sightseeing might be enjoyable. We will now take my leave. Farewell, Earth 11. Alright. He left. Oh, thank Now then, this sounds interesting. Well, why don't we go try it, Captain? Yeah! 
but we will try that in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. I'm gonna save up the game and well, once again, thank you all so much for watching. Um, it's been a blast and then I say one thing and that is later. Goodbye guys.